from Dundu in America and thank you guys for coming here and listening to my story. I am originally from Delaware but I moved here two years ago with my partner and we just had a baby boy about seven months ago. His name is Christopher. Um, I want to tell you guys a little bit about my song, The Fadu Had to Move, which you can listen to on YouTube, uh, Dengu in America. And I also want to tell you guys about my trip to Indonesia. I went to Indonesia in 2017. It was a lot of fun and I cannot wait to go back and to meet all my fans and all my friends in Indonesia. Um, when I was there, I got to meet Roma e Rama. Bila kamu di sisiku ada izin, bila kamu di sisiku, bila kamu, bila kamu, bila kamu. Um, and I got to sit down with him, and I got to sing with him, and he taught me a little bit of his song called Chahadu, and I'd love to sing that for you guys and sing you guys a little clip. Um, there it goes. Bila kamu di sisiku, hati rasa satu satu hari tak bertemu, hati rasa satu. Guys, this was such a hard song for me to learn. It was such a great experience in being able to sit down with Roma Irama and the King of Dungu. It was so amazing. He taught me about the sound and the rhythm of Dungu and it was really just an amazing experience and I cannot wait to go back to Indonesia and spend some time there and work on music and meet all my fans and all my friends. I cannot wait. I'm so excited. I tried a lot of different food in Indonesia. I've tried noodles and rice. I even tried some duck. Um, and the culture of the food is so different and the food is so delicious and has a lot of flavor. I remember trying this chicken on a stick. It was a little stick with a little bit of chicken on it. And I can't remember the name of it, but I think I could maybe browse the internet and figure out what it is. I also tried noodles from one of the malls out there that was super delicious, super tasty. Um, Indonesian food is very different from American food. We have a lot of subs and gyros and pizza here. And you guys have a lot of rice and pasta and noodles. But I really, really, really enjoyed the food there. It's super tasty and I cannot wait to go back to Indonesia and experience it again and try all the different foods that I've never tried before. I even tried a fruit called a papaya that I've never tried here. I know they have it in America, but I the first time I had it was in Indonesia and I remember Rissa cut me a piece and it was super juicy and tasty. It was so good. Um, so I'm really excited to go back and experience all the culture and try new foods and sing more music and learn about the Dungdu Dung -du culture so much more and I'm just super excited guys. I also want to sing for you guys Go Young Du Mang by Tita Titata because that's one of my favorite Dungdu songs besides Roma I Rama song Shahadu. Um, and here it is. Sakira Sunya Patu Shinta Sesanya Dida Da Membua Kita Jari Gugana Kalisa Kalamarana Mendinga Kita Happy A Child The Back and Samua Body Lakita Go Young Go Sama Go Young Du Manya Maya that is one of my favorite songs. Oh, guys, and Akuma Apa Aku. Akuma Apa Atu. You must link who hung Kamu at 
kumaapa atu cuma jaluk kalam. Okay, I forgot the words. chicken that I said that I really liked from Indonesia but I could not remember the name and I'm gonna google it and show you guys. Come join me. It is called Indonesian chicken saute. It's chicken on a stick and it's super delicious and I've tried it from a few different restaurants but it's super good. It's like in a little sauce and a little gravy with rice, it's so delicious and so good. There's also another noodle that I really like from Indonesia. Fried noodles, mi goreng, mi goreng, mi goreng. It's super delicious. If you look right here, this is it. Super tasty, has a lot of flavor, a lot of spice. Not super spicy, but like has a lot of flavor. Um, and I tried it at one of the Indonesian malls. I forget the name of it, but it was super delicious. And I cannot wait to go back to Indonesia and get me a huge bowl of noodles. And chicken. Saute chicken. Super delicious. Also tried a different type of meat. It wasn't it wasn't chicken. It was I believe it was duck, and it was super delicious too. And I think it is called an Indonesian. Duck curry, I think is what it was called. It was super delicious. It is called gula sapi padang. Gula bibi, curry duck, super delicious, um, super spicy, tasted like it had like a lot of turmeric in it, a, a lot of curry. I also, when we first got to Indonesia and we got off the plane, we went to a place, it was really late at night, I forget the name of it, but I think it was a Chinese food or a Japanese food, and I tried, um, what's the name of it? A little cute tofu. I was not a big fan of the tofu, but we had another different type of rice that was super good, and I don't really remember the name of it, but it was really delicious. Um, and I also tried some fish there, which is different because they actually had the fish cut in half and they kept the head on. So that was interesting for me because here we don't do that. In America, we fillet the fish, so that was a lot different too. Um, can show you a picture of that as well. It kind 
of look like this right here. They keep the head on it, and it was actually pretty tasty. It was pretty good. I'm really excited. I can't wait to go back to Indonesia and try the different meals and the different food and have that chicken saute again. That was super delicious and the noodles. to visit there. So the next time I go to Indonesia, this is on my bucket list. I would love to visit here. Hi, so Marina, where would you like to go when uh, your next travel to Indonesia? I would really love to explore and go to Bali. That would be such a great experience. They have beautiful beaches, clear water, and it's just a beautiful place to be, and I would really love to go there. Um, when I was in, in when I was in Indonesia, I visited Jakarta, which was the capital, and that was really nice as well. Um, but I would definitely love to take a different plane to Bali and experience the beach life, and maybe even do a performance there. That would be really, really cool. Sasha 
you so much for joining me today on this new episode of TBRI. Um, I think we're going to wrap it up. You followed me downtown. You got to see my lifestyle and how I live. I got to do some songs for you and some challenges. And it was a lot of fun. And I, you know, I really cannot wait to go back to Indonesia. But it's time for me to get some rest and wrap this up. So you guys have a great evening and a great time. And Terima kasih. See you guys.